be able to solve this problem, we're going to need to use the following property that says if you have two chords that intersect within the circle, then the product of the segments of each of the chords are going to be equal. Okay. So to be able to do that, we're first going to need to be able to find this value here from this point where the two chords intersect up to the radius. Well, I know that since the radius is 15.7, I know this entire length here is also 15.7. So I know that 5.6 plus y will equal 15.7. So that means y must equal 10.1. Okay. So to be able to use this property, we need to know this entire length here and this entire length here. Okay. Well, we found that this was equal to 10.1. So this entire length will be 10.1 plus 15.7 or 25.8. Okay, so 25.8. So the two values we're going to use to multiply are 5.6 and 25.8. So 5.6 times 25.8 equals 12 times x. Okay. So 5.6 times 25.8. Why will it not hit my 2? Sorry. <laughs> 2, 5.8. 144.48. So 144.48 is equal to 12x. So let's divide that by 12 to get what x is equal to. Divided by 12, divided by 12. So 12.04 is equal to x, but it does say to round to the nearest tenth if necessary. So if we were to round this, this would round to 12.0. Okay, or just 12. <laughs> 